Well, hello and welcome to another video editing simplified tutorial. Today we're going to talk about chroma keying. You know, this is one of the neatest effects that you can do in most any video editing software. The ability to superimpose one image or one video over another. It's a great effect. You've seen it all the time in the broadcasting. Uh, you know, when a weather person stands there and they have the big United States map behind them, well, they're using chroma keying. They're actually standing in front of a blue or green screen and they're superimposing the map or the weather map on top of them. So how do we do that? Well, I'll show you how to do it in Vegas Movie Studio, and uh, let's try it out right here. First of all, we have a few different backgrounds, and anything that we're going to green screen or chroma key is going to be on top of our background. So we've got a little character here, a little uh, guy with a video camera, and obviously we can see the green screen. We don't want to see that. So what do we do? Well, let's first of all go to Video Effects and go down to the Chroma Keyer. Pick out the green screen, left click and drag down to our top uh, uh, clip right there. And you can see that already most of that background is gone, but there's a little bit of a frame here and we don't want that to show up. So how do we fix that? We go right back down here and click Show Mask Only. What that's going to do is make everything a white color. And that way we can see what we have to change to make it look better. I'm going to adjust the low threshold, and you notice the back, the frame back there is disappearing. We want to adjust it just enough so it disappears, not any more than we have to. And then we're going to take the high threshold and back that off until the element that we want to see is completely white, as white as possible. And that shows us that it's going to show up a lot better once we take out the show mask only. So as you can see, it, uh, the very nice graphic here is superimposed on top of our beach scene. Let's try something different here. Most of the time, you're maybe if you're going to do tutorials or marketing uh, uh, videos, you're going to want to superimpose perhaps your face over a background. How do you do that? Well, first of all, you've got to get a green screen. They run about $70, $80 on up. And uh, set that behind you. And as you can see right here, we're going to take the green screen off of this first of all so we show you how we use it. And I have a crazy little character, Mr. Willie, here. And obviously, you can see the green screen. We want to get rid of that. So once again, we're going to take the green screen function of the, the video effects, and we're going to drag it down to our clip. And automatically, we see that most of the green is gone, but we still need to adjust it a little bit. We're going to click on the show mask only, and we're going to adjust the low threshold up until all those wrinkles disappear as best we can do it. And then we're going to take the high threshold, back that up, and try to get Mr. Willie as white as possible. And there he is right there. Then we're going to remember to click, unclick the show mask only. And now our character is superimposed behind a nice sunset scene, or magically he could be behind a cityscape scene here, and most anything you can do. Now another great thing is you can stick your logo or whatever you want to do behind there. Let's adjust that logo just a little bit so it looks a bit nicer here. We'll raise it up like that. And so we have a very nice graphic. We have a very nice superimposed image over a nice background. It makes your tutorials, your ads, everything just sparkle and look great. This has been another video editing simplified tutorial.